Hey everybody, Star Jacobs here, and today we're back with some more BFE Redux. Alright, so first things first, let's take out this annoying Harpy. Then we'll grab all supplies. This is what it sounds like when doves cry. And also go for the secrets after I kill all this stuff here, because in order to properly show it off, I think I might as well just clear out the enemies. Thankfully it's made a little bit easier by the fact that you get an early sniper rifle. Thank you, Sirius Amaro. Very cool of you. There is another co-op quest secret, so I'll go ahead and pick up the first part, since it's like right there. Also, the second part's not that hard to find either. It's actually right behind this wall. Yeah, so let's just rocket these guys. Eh, you know what, I'll also go for this secret, because why not? Might as well. Yeah, so you get a giant laser battery, turning it around, of course, to spawn in this, and also a early wearable. I uh, hear the clears, but I'm not sure where they are. I think they're all behind that dumpster. Yeah, okay. They all just bunched up for some reason. Idiots. Behind this box, you can find the third health pill. Also, some extra sniper bullets. Very nice. Also, extra rockets. That's good. Although, I think the rockets might have already been there. I'm not sure. Yes, yeah, Sniper is still proving to be very useful at taking out these biomechs. This part I'm taking kind of slow. Oh, that's actually the reason I was taking it slow, is because I didn't really want to spawn him it just yet. Alright, well he's dead. That's fine. Uh, behind here you can find more C4. Might as well take it. Also, get rid of him. Oh. Okay, and hopefully that should be everything. So let's grab the remaining health pills to complete the co-op secret. So one's behind that slanted bookcase, or bookshelf. There are some supplies up here, including C4, which of course I want. Here you have the parkour secret. Doesn't really do anything. And lastly, if you jump up on this building. Might take you a few tries. You'll get a secret cannon. And that is the co-op quest done. Very nice reward too, I might add. Okay, then we'll grab the extra laser ammo and I think that should be it for this area. I don't think I missed anything. Yeah, so with that area done we can jump up on this to grab this. And here's where you would normally get the sniper rifle if you're not playing co-op, just doing single player. Which is why it brings up the instructions on how to use it. It's still actually a pretty cool quality of life thing. Makes it feel closer to a AAA game. Oh yeah, and also enjoy an early scrapjack. Well, let's some more harpies go away. Yeah, look out for this clear. And there's three Nars that will spawn. Nothing too crazy. Also, watch out for the giant scorpion. Make sure to get rid of it. 
And this is actually a very chaotic area. Lots of hit scanners. Also sniping reptiloids. There's just a lot of enemies, especially hit scanners that are very deadly, so I always try to go for those first if I can. Also, thank God for the secret laser rifle, it definitely helps. Yeah, not really too much to say here, just keep him focused because it is pretty hectic as you can see. Lots of enemies just randomly spawning in from two different fronts. But I think I got them all, so now we can go back here, grab some lasers, and also stock up on armor a little bit. Yeah, Nar just completely ran by me. I'm back here, you idiot. So next up on my list is this area, which spawns two clears and a bunch of beheaded on either side. I like to clear it out just so that I have some extra room to move later on, or maneuver rather. Oh yeah, also I shouldn't forget about the official secret laser rifle. It only gives 20 cells, but whatever. 20 cells on pickup that is. Oh, and I think I angered... yeah, there's a spawn over here for these enemies. Uh, thankfully I didn't get hit. Yeah, let's grab these health pills. Finish off those guys. Ah, fuck it, they can stay, I don't care. I'll kill them in due time anyway. Picking up these supplies will spawn another Scrapjack. Also a Reptiloid. Nothing too bad. Okay. Should be good. So now let's go for the laser. Oh, still more enemies, okay. Ah, here they are. Nothing too bad. Uh, the big scorpion sees me. That's not good. But he's probably gonna duck back behind cover, so I don't really care. Let's tag these two secrets, especially the useless one, since it's pretty forgettable. Yeah, there really is nothing there. Not even in this mod, so... bummer. Okay, looking pretty good on supplies. Do be aware that on either side, if you push up too far, there's going to be an extra fight, so... If you want 100%, or you're just trying to be careful, then just be aware. Hello, Nar. Is that gonna hit him? Ooh, nice. It did. Actually pretty impressed. Ow, I need to learn how to strafe. Go back to strafing school. Just walk in and projectiles left and right. Okay, I'm out. I heard a small scorpion. Oh, he's way out of range. Okay. Plus, I want to get rid of you first. Just make it a little easier to approach him. Are you gonna shoot? Come on. Yeah, there it goes. 
Okay, now let's bum rush him. Not to C4. And then if you come back on this side, as you can see, it spawns and clears. Nothing too crazy on this side, but just like a fair warning that there are extra enemies to kill. Okay, and I hope that's it. Hope I didn't miss anything either. I would like to get 100 kills, or 100% kills. If possible, I mean, it's not like a requirement for me, but it is kind of nice to see full kills, you know? Because it really does... Because that really truly is the 100% experience. Normally I don't do it, though, because one, I don't really care to, and two, like... Serious Sam is pretty infamous for its broken kills. And I'm honestly not sure how... tested the kill count is in this. In single player, I know it's accurate. In co-op, though, I have no idea. I mean, I don't doubt it is, but... Getting all those kills is kind of tricky. Okay, so here's round two. This one is pretty difficult. So what I like to do is snipe the werewolves, and then toss a C4 to take care of the clears quickly. And then, that means I can actually push up to here to quickly dispatch these two scorpions. And you. Don't forget about you. Uh, where's the other soldier? I know I heard one. Are you inside the building? No. What the hell? Where to go? I know you're around here. You're not fooling anybody. Yeah, let me grab those C4, then I'll go forward. Oh wait, I think he's up there. Yeah, I see you. Let's grab these supplies and then fall back. Ow, stupid spider. Hate that shit. Took care of them. Then we'll focus on. Oh my god, they keep blocking my sniper bullets. They're fat ass rockets. There. That's better. Okay, if you don't mind me, I think I'll go back for some of this armor. I'm not gonna go all the way back, just pick up the helmets and leave. I mean, they're close, might as well have them. Yeah, just like that, we got bolstered back up pretty much to 100. Got some more. Oh, you know what? Oh yeah, soldiers. There. Not anymore. Let me see how well I can push up on this scorpion. I also have a feeling I'm probably gonna trigger this fight. Yeah, I already did, okay. Not a problem.
Ow. Bam. Oh yeah, that's Scorpion. Yeah, get another melee section. Sweet. Okay, and hopefully I didn't do the last part because... There's actually a few things that I missed. So this isn't a secret, but it is a small ambush, just for fun. That's actually one of the reasons I wanted to do the fights, is to see if like my armor dropped any lower. That way it wouldn't feel like such a waste to pick up the 50. Turned out okay. Oh yeah, and it also spawns a reptiloid on the roof over there after beating it. Originally, I think it spawned like a red scorpion, but I guess got changed out for whatever reason. Or maybe I'm just misremembering entirely. Anyway, we have this. Get four C charges. Four C4 charges, thank you. And you only use three of them, so I guess you get net positive of one. whoop de doo at least we have some here. That's good. Okay. And now we'll just push forward. I forget if there's anything here. Oh yeah, some rockets. That's always nice. And yeah, this fight. Yeah, rockets and sniper bullets are your best friend in this map. Also, C4 does get a fair amount of play, so that's good. Yeah, kill those. Then kill the Reptiloid. Also grab these supplies while I'm at it. Sadly, there's not really a way to get back here. I thought at first maybe there would be a secret, but nah, it's just invisible wall. Oh well. You do have some health pills though. Also some more over here. And two secrets back to back. This one's good obviously because it gives you those laser cells. Then if you climb up here and don't fall off like I just did, you can get a parkour secret. I think it's like a 10 health vial thing that you pick up. Okay. Oh, nice. Their projectiles collided midair. That's cool. Alright, so for this, I'll mainly use the assault rifle just because they're soldiers. And of course, their hit scan attacks suck. Oh, I only had nine bullets, okay. Okay, then back here you can find another scorpion. Let's get him. Alright, back there is a secret which will also spawn in a fight, but before I do that, I'll kill the spider, and if you come back here into this alleyway it will spawn three Nars to kill. Yeah, here they are. Not really sure why. I guess because in the original there was like a health item or something, and they're just there for fun. But anyway, got ourselves a minigun. And, of course, with any minigun, there's going to be a fight to go with it. Yes, there's an early version of the clear fight that you will, of course, get later. 
And it's pretty good. Also has some reptiloids, which you can either shoot rockets at or just minigun. Whatever you fancy. Or even sniper, but now I'll just stick with the main gun. Okay, and for the end, I'd like to just do that. Just toss a few C4 because it spawns in a bunch of clears behind them. Oh yeah, it's also another secret, that big bundle of rockets that you just saw. For now, I'm gonna ignore it. Okay, now I'll grab them. Get rid of him. I'll snipe that one. And I think you deserve a C4. Yeah, that's what you get. Yeah, good old fashioned Rocket Festival secret brought back in all of its glory with the rocketiest of rocket enemies. Now you might be wondering, okay, how come I haven't used the cannon? Well, mainly because I'm gonna save it for the final fight. Not necessarily for the warship, but there's a lot of big enemies in the final arena. And now it's actually like a proper arena fight instead of just being kind of an afterthought. Okay. One last ambush as far as I'm aware and then we can finally do the last area. So there's four werebulls, they all just kind of spawn in one after the other. Yeah, not bad at all. Let's break this, grab the armor. Ooh, more armor, yes please. Okay. And before we drop down, let me double check. 15, ah oh shit, what did I miss? Ah. Uh... Oh wait, did I grab that laser pickup? Pretty sure I did. Oh, I think I forgot the laser rifle. Damn, that sucks. That means I have to run all the way back. But first, let me check on this, just in case this is what I missed. I'm hoping that's the case. Okay, yeah, it was. Phew. Thank god I didn't have to run literally all the way back to the start of the map. I kind of thought in the back of my head, like, maybe I forgot that one. Turns out I did. Good. If I'm gonna miss any secret, then please let it be a close one like that. <laughs> Otherwise, I kind of feel obligated to restart the recording, so... Looking good. Not really sure how many kills we're supposed to have, but I'll just keep my fingers crossed and hope for the best. Yeah, so as you can see, game will just spawn in a bunch of ammo. Cannonballs included. And yeah, I think it's time. So it starts out like the typical harp harpy spam, but it does get a lot more difficult. Lots of scrapjacks, Biomech Miners, Beheaded, Kamikazes and Rocketeers, Reptiloids, a few Biomech Majors for good measure. It's a true, it's like a proper final fight, you know? Proper what you would expect from a final fight. Okay, let's pick up the sniper bullets. Yeah, so the biggest thing is just keep moving and select your targets. Okay, hopefully that gets him. Let's see, how do we do? Yeah, he's stunned. Good. Yeah, you I want to use a rocket on. 
We're not rocking the cannonball. There's a reptiloid sniping me from way back there. He needs to go. I think I'll use a laser just to get rid of these spiders. Also, that one needs to go. You also need to go. Everything must go. Like a giant sail elementals forward. Yeah, there's another reptiloid he needs to die. I also hear another biomech. Oh yeah, and also a Technopala. Butchy thing. Uh, who else? Werebowl. Okay. That must die. You need to go. Oh, I'm missing a few kills. Probably scrapjacks and other shit. Oh, that's a bad angle. I can't really do much of that. Please don't insta kill me. Thank you. Ah, oh, still missing a few. Damn. That's horrible. Oh, there's one. I know what the Scrapjacks or official enemies are put into the map. Okay, hopefully when all these enemies despawn I can see what there is. Oh, another Scrapjack. Oh my god, I'm missing one. No. Where? Fuck. Damn. Well, okay, that sucks. I got all the secrets, though, so I'm happy about that at least. Looks like we are back to the curse of missing exactly one enemy. That's a bummer. Well, whatever. Fun level. I like the boss. Scrapjacks are a nice inclusion into the level, and that final fight's surprisingly difficult. So that's basically all I got for you guys today. Thank you so much for watching, hope you enjoyed, and I will see you in the next one. Peace.